Hello everyone, my name is Iris Franz, Wu Xiaobian Wan Ru. Today we're going to continue to talk about the second theorem of welfare economics. And in this clip I'm going to show you, in this economy, if there's any agent's preference that is not convex preference, then we cannot guarantee that a Pareto efficient outcome is also a market equilibrium. So in this example, we have uh, Alice and Bob. And you can see that Bob's preference is a convex preference, but not Alice's preference. And at point X, you can see that is an efficient outcome because at point X, we cannot improve Alice's utility without hurting Bob and vice versa. So X is efficient. And we can see that the tangent um, of the indifference curve of Alice and also Bob. So here we draw a tangent line and let this be the budget line. Now you will ask, can this price ratio clear the market? And the answer is no. So why not? Suppose our initial endowment is W. And uh, Bob will say that, you know what, I'd like to move to point X. But Alice will say, you know what, I prefer to move to point Y. So why is that? You can see clearly, um, given this budget line, Point X really is the best for Bob. But for Alice, Alice will say, look, if I move to point Y, then um, my, indif my indifference curve is higher than um, point X indifference curve, meaning I have a higher utility level at point Y. So suppose this is an initial endowment W, and Alice will say, I want to move to point Y given this price ratio, and therefore, I want to buy more good one, and I want to sell my good two to buy my good one. What about Bob? Bob will say, I want to move to X, meaning I want to uh, sell my good two and buy some good one. So you can see both Alice and Bob are saying, I want to buy more good one, and I want to sell my good two. So both of them are saying that, then that's going to cause a shortage of good one and a surplus of good two. So, when we have shortage and surplus, that means our market is not cleared, meaning we do not have a market equilibrium. So, I hope this helps, and I'll see you next time.